So we're on our way to Adagam Bay, which is one of the surf places in Sri Lanka. It's on the East Coast. Really great waves, but on the way we did see a cool bridge. So we're heading from the Dambula area, Suguria area to Adagam Bay. And as you can see on the uh, five rupee currency here, that's the Mana Mapitaya Bridge. We're passing it. So guys, this is Peanut Farm Surfing Point, basically. It's right next to a military base, but wow, what a nice little adobe house. Or did cement adobe here on the beach. It's great. Looks like the surf could be good, but it's all straight on shore. Well, it's not on shore. Waves are blown out. They're not big enough. But yeah, I bet this is a good break sometimes. So we're gonna do a little body surf in here. At Peanut Farm Beach. Pretty nice. Yeah, not bad. Not good enough to surf today. Waves are too small and it's blown out, but definitely still a lot of fun. And it's a little bit nicer here than at the hotel I'm staying at in town. So, uh, yeah, awesome. it this way uh forward or this way forward okay yeah, no. okay here we go guys <laughs> how much time is it Get out. Half an hour. okay cool okay so this way no lean Lean this way? No, lean this way. <laughs> Alright, All right, so a bit of a sunset session here on a little outrigger. Totally possible I could sink this boat. <laughs> we'll see. Crocodile? No. Elephant, sometimes.
right, so we're here with Ren Oversee on his YouTube channel. You got my YouTube channel, Explore with Stone. Uh, we're out here exploring Sri Lanka, so uh, I'm it's a sure. Great time here. It's raining on and off. Absolutely, so it keeps me cool. Absolutely, <laughs> cool. I don't even know your name. I know your YouTube channel, Renee. Yeah. Renee, nice to meet you. Nice to meet I'm you. I'm Eric. Eric, yeah. nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Watch our YouTube channels. We'll catch you guys later. Okay. Right. Thank you very much. All right. So tonight we're here at a restaurant called Serendib, um, getting a whole fish to white snapper, 2,500 rupees. It's a lot, but uh, they're gonna grill it on the grill outside, so that's kind of cool. I ate here at the the, uh, the other night last night, got some calamari. Um, it was pretty good. Came with some salad and uh, some rice, and not bad. They have uh, passion fruit juice too, which is great. Love it. One of my favorites. No sugar, so it's a bit sour. Reminds me of the uh, tumbo juice in Peru, which is. Uh, similar to the passion fruit, um, but it really only exists in Peru. I have not seen tumbo juice anywhere else. All right, guys, we got my fish cooking here on the grill. It's a white snapper. It's okay if I video record you? Yeah. You want to be it? All right. So this is the, the cook here, the chef. He's, he's cooking my fish on the grill. We're here at the uh, Serendib Aragambe uh, restaurant. So this is my second time here. And uh, he's about been out here grilling since yesterday, at least. You know, I'm sure a lot longer than that. But, uh, but I saw them out here. They got the fresh fish out here on the, uh, the ice tray. So um, this was a too big of a fish for me. So I got one of these regular sized guys. So, but that is my fish on the grill. And I'm gonna eat that too. Very, very high. My fish has come. It's awesome. This is a white snapper. It's still steaming there. You can see the steam coming right off of it. So uh, it's gonna be great. They typically, so this is grilled fish. But typically they cook the whole fish, you know, they clean it and everything, but you do have to pick up out the bones, kind of a standard thing. Flays are sort of rare in South Asia. So, but you know, it's up to the customer to get all the meat out of it possible. If you fillet a fish, a lot of meat is wasted, so. It's time to hit the road again, leave Argam Bay and go see Welligama.